I'm Elizabeth Palmer in London, where police say today's attack was not only terrorism, it was also a hate crime. The driver of the truck, who witnesses say shouted, I want to kill Muslims, barreled into a small group of people near a North London mosque. The attacker, identified as 47-year-old Darren Osborne, was pinned to the ground, shielded by some bystanders while others pushed to get their hands on him. The local imam made sure he was handed over to the police. Mohammed Mahmoud. We told them the situation that there's a man, he's restrained, he mowed down a group of people with his van, and there's a mob, uh, and there's a mob attempting to hurt him. Just over two weeks ago, Londoners were paying their respects to victims of the last attack with a rented van on London Bridge by self-proclaimed Islamic extremists. Even then, security forces were dreading the kind of tit-for-tat terrorist violence that could rip holes in London's multicultural fabric. Today, Britain's Prime Minister Theresa May appeared with religious leaders of all faiths to appeal one more time for solidarity. There is no place for this hatred in our country today and we need to work together as one society, as one community to drive it out this evil that is affecting so many families. British media are reporting that the attacker Darren Osborne was a father of four who lived in Wales. The security services said that he wasn't on their radar at all, but tonight his family is saying that he had been what they called troubled for some time. Anthony? Elizabeth Palmer in London. Thanks, Liz.